one afternoon camper is about half past two. We're still down at Hive. We've pulled around the front here um, on a disabled bay. I'm not sure um, where exactly we're to. Right, chap? And um, that's the disabled bay there. And I was a little bit left at the back there. So I wrote Ron a squeeze in there and stick his badge up. Um, mate, he's parked here. He's parked quite well. But I think he can get out past me. If not, he can reverse back. Um, we're going we're to have a little walk in the town. But what's happening, I don't know. But this is where we're to. I just in Lewis car park. And I come out of... Um, I come out of the car, I'll let you have a little look about. And I'll chat to you. Yeah, we come out of Little's car park and I come out and no entry, and no exit. But it was only written on the road and I didn't sort of see it until I'd gone past it. And I come out and I couldn't get round this little twat, well, big twat and a fucking little micro. He sat there and he got, he got out and he come up and he said, do you know? He said, this is no entry, no exit. And I went, yeah. And he went, oh. I said, but do I look like anybody that actually gives a fuck? Oh, well, you've got to... I said, anyway, so I got back in there. I went, just fuck up and move your car. So I got back in the van, and he sat there. And he sat there for about... I well, spent half a minute. I bet he sat there for about three fucking seconds. And I'm out again, and I just fucking reared right up on him. Oh, he said, oh, sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Wound his window and reversed back. We know I'd nothing to be sorry about. He was completely in the fucking right, wasn't he? But I just lost the fucking plot. And I don't like losing the plot. You know, well, I mean, what's he going to do? He wants to turn in where I'm to. He can't turn in. I can't go backwards because there's a car behind me. And, um... I can't go backwards because there's a car behind me. And he's just sat there. And he's got, well, a gateway that must be... 30 foot wide and about oh, another 30 or 40 foot to there. He could have, he could have bloody gone in there and turned round. And um, I thought that was him then. <laughs> yeah, and um, that was it really. But um, I think me and Ron's going to park up here and go for a beer. But we're deciding on whether we can park up here all night because we might as well, we might as well sort of stay here. But um, What's going to happen? I ain't got a clue. But he's he been breaking his neck for a pee for two bloody hours, and he's gone by bushes and gone by little bits he could have a wee, but he hasn't. So he certainly don't need a pee like I need a pee when I want one. So he'll be trying to find me now. So I stay down here and um, do what I got to do. And that's it. <coughs> yeah. So. Uh, here you go. Um, yeah. I got into a place there that do mugs. And I've sort of seen them done. I'm just wondering if I could have a word with them. Where they would do them by post. I didn't go in there to buy a mug, but she just said, she said, oh, you can have any colour you want printed on the back, any colour you want printed on the front. But the um, thing is, if... I pay her by joy row, or I pay her by money transfer, and she does them up, and then sends them out. Then, I don't know whether to do it or not, really. But my mate Ali, she said there's a place in Westbury that does it. So I might go in there. So I've got one mug with Travelling Chalks World written on it. But I can't see anyone fucking mug of my name on it. And they certainly want a mug with my mug on it. <laughs> so, um, that's it. But I can't calm down. I'm still fucking livid, aren't I? The pressure's the fucking heart's going like a good one. You know, shouldn't be rearing up in my age, should I? Anyway, peeps, I'll let you go. And uh, you have a little look around. It is a beautiful spot here. So, that's what I'm going to say. If you go from where I'm to and go round. That boat's called Split 2. I don't understand why that is. I expect this uh, thing back to there. But it's certainly nice up here. And there's somewhere up there you can sit right out on the water. So it's certainly nice, a certainly nice little spot to sit. 
to our speech or later. I mean, I don't know where Ron is. I wonder where he ain't come down and caught up with me. And to our speech or later, remember, stay classy, you know, quite saying, love you all. Bye bye. And you skins.